So welcome back to my channel. This is Gamer Dom, and this is the Evil T49, the Tier Nine um, American light tank. Oh, I'm going blind. And I'm going blank here with this. So yeah, this is the thing with that Evil 152 millimeter gun on it, the Derp Cannon. It's like a KV2, a Tier Nine that moves around as a light tank. It is evil little bastard frankly uh, it's driven here for us by private parts uh, he sent this uh, he sent this game in uh, for me to have a look at and I thought it's kind of fun he um, let's just say he doesn't have his best day as a shooter um, but um, he makes up for it in other ways and that's the beauty of playing a light tank so it's an assault gun here on assault gun assault game on Corellia that uh, AMX doesn't oh wow well, that was pretty horrible shot, that one. Didn't really allow it to aim in at all. But look at the spotting he's doing. Got forward into a nice position. He's got an AMX behind him. Reloaded. The dirt cannon is not particularly um, effective at distance. And sure enough, uh, he missed him. <laughs> Did take a shot from the T43, knocked out his driver, repaired the driver, patched up the driver, not repaired the driver. It's already done 2,000 damage, 2,000 spotting damage. Sorry. Look at the other side, Private. You might have a shot on the MX. no point taking that shot. What are the enemy team doing? They all seem just sitting around the cap. Extraordinary. Now he's going to have a go at the AMX. Can he get a shot? Aiming in. Oh wow it takes forever to aim in. Wait for the full aim and he hits! Yay! 460 hit. Probably did module damage in all sorts. It's 3 place 2. The MX 1390 is down, but it cost us our Su 122.54. We push up into the middle. He wants to spot all these guys for all the TDs and everything else that's sitting behind. Oh, there's an MX. Hello. Oh, had to rush the shot a bit there because the MX was about to fire. But no worries, uh, his friends behind him have given that AMX a bit of a kicking. There's a uh, Waffle Traeger sitting at the back there. He also is now getting kicking. He's done 4,000 spotting damage without really being terribly effective with his gun. But, you know, that's what light tanks do. That's what they can do is... Oh, I mean, that's... Ah, uh, didn't... He rushed that shot because he didn't want to uh, get hit by that AMX. But actually... He was pretty safe. He could have aimed in there. Got a little bit of a case of premature um, firing. Premature ejaculation of a 152mm shell. There we go. Oh, and then... Oh, the, that, just, that just sucks. He finally aims the shell properly. Fully aimed on the AMX. Um, gets spotted by the Waffle Taker and takes a 500 hit himself. But the fully aimed shot on the MX does not even land close. But never mind, MX is now down, which frees up Private again. He's trying to spot that Waffle, tra waffle Traeger. There's a lot of enemy nasty TDs in the middle here. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm referencing the. Revelize is a TD because that thing has a gun like a TD. Okay, so he reckons he's safe for the moment. There's the Revelize. More sig behind you, mate. More sig behind you. Oh, he's not looking at you. He's looking at you. And he gets the kill. Not sure that necessarily even hit directly. I think he hit the rock beside and it was splash damage that killed him. But that will happen in 100, with 152 HE. So, he's into this position. Got to wait for a minute or two, wait for the inevitable spot to disappear. 
before he decides what to do next. The artillery is almost certainly going to be looking at him, or at least paying attention to his mini-map. There's an IS-6 out there. It looks like he's going to try to keep the IS-6 interested and lit up for our TDs and artillery. Can't get the gun down on the IS-6. Get behind this rock here. Watch your other side, Private. Oh, he gets lucky. He blocks an IS-6 shell. But there you go, the Waffle Throw, the WZ-131, uh, sorry. I could see him on the mini-map, was coming up behind him, but Private was a little bit tunnel-visioned. Down to two more rounds. He's done 5,000, nearly 6,000 assistance damage so far. Can't see the uh, waffle. Can you see the light tank? Aim in, aim in, aim in. Oh. <laughs> I, I, the only conclusion I can come to is that his gunner is completely pissed out of his head. Because did you see that shell? He was fully aimed. He waited, he waited, he waited. Okay, the WZ was pulling back. But that shell went about, I don't know, 10 metres to the right of where it was aimed. <laughs> Oh well, he's won the game anyway. Good job. Nicely done. If you can't hit things, scout. Well, some days you just don't have your shooting boots on, do you? Um, but uh, luckily, he still did his job as a light tank, and that helped carry this to a victory. He got a second class for that. He got spotter, uh, bruiser, and patrol duty for spotting. How many do you have to spot there? Uh, at least six enemy vehicles. Um, get damaged by you so one two three four five six seven by his team sorry uh finished up well there you go top of the team only did 872 damage and got one kill but uh, 1052 base xp which is a pretty good return because it's largely down to almost 6,000 spotting damage 5,926 spotting he did nine uh, fired nine shots <laughs> only three of them got anywhere close to the target uh, for that um, 400, oh, what did do? 800 damage. Uh, just shows, you know, people always say, how the hell do you do the spotting missions and what have you? He didn't hide in the bush. He kept moving. He was, uh, you can do active spotting like that. Um, and he kept popping up, uh, lighting up the enemy uh, for his friends behind to shoot them. Of course, you are reliant on your friends shooting things, but they certainly did in that game. 50,000 credits. Uh, it's expensive to run as a, as a tier 9, as most tier 9s are, but even not firing many shells, he only made 26,500 profit. Um, and it was his times two, so 3,160 experience. So, yeah, don't worry about your gun, just spot and rely on other people's guns to win the game. That's the motto of that game. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a like and please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so. In the meantime, enjoy your game, have fun, try not to take it too seriously. It's just a game after all. And I'll see you again soon. This is Gamer Dom signing out.